Dictionaries in C Sharp are user-defined collections. They are used in pairs, keys, and values that correspond to each key. The keys and the values can be of any data type. To implement a dictionary in C Sharp, the generic class should be imported into the program. Let's add using system.collections.generic over here for that. The constructor of the dictionary in C Sharp takes two parameters, key and value. The following program implements the dictionary that contains a key of the data type string and a value of the data type integer. The dictionary is created to store the days of the week along with their values from 1 to 7. The dictionary days is initiated here. The object days references the dictionary class. The add method is used to populate the dictionary class created. The add method takes in two parameters, the key and the value. Notice that the days of the week, Monday, Tuesday, and so on till Sunday, are the values, and integers 1 to 7 are the keys. The elements of a dictionary are iterated using the for each statement. Let's compile and run the code. You can notice that the keys and their respective values got printed. You can also ask for the value from the user and return the key as the output. Let's modify the code and insert a console.readline statement to get the value and an if condition to print the respective statement as the output. Now let's compile the code. The console window asks for the value. Let's enter 3 for the value. The day Wednesday is a value 3 is the output statement over here. The if statement checks the condition for each value provided in the for each loop, and the condition is true only for Wednesday. Like other collections in C-sharp, the dictionary also contains methods like remove and clear, amongst others.